Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Lucas Monster, and welcome back to Astro Near. Uh, if you guys did miss the last episode, please go watch that one because, uh, as you can see, we got ourselves into a little bit of a pickle. Um, in this episode, we're gonna try to get out, and we're gonna go ahead and find the burrito as well. So, really excited about that. But first thing we gotta do is try to get out of this mess that we got ourselves into. And uh, basically, I attached a winch to one of my things here. Uh, and it just went crazy and I can't unattach the winch and so um, I made a packager we're gonna try to package up the winch and hopefully that gets rid of the problem but I can't even drive this thing so I grab the winch okay wait I'm gonna flip it again it's gonna get stuck oh there's the winch okay winch right here that's what I want okay it's it's staying still that's what, exactly what we want let's do that package okay that basically just solved our problem hopefully we can drive now um that would that would be nice <laughs> i also have no idea where i am because i pretty much went halfway across the world but we're gonna try our best to get out of here okay so we finally made it back that was a trek and a half to get up here um but we finally made it back to base that was a wild ride i thought i had lost everything um, but we got everything back here now. Okay, so there's a few things I want to do now that I have this stuff up here. I want to see how much points, uh, some of this stuff will get me. Like, for example, earlier we found out the Cosmic Squash gets us 518. Um, I want to figure out how much does the Omni Nugget get us. Okay, so the Omni Nugget is 888. Wow. That is a lot. Yes, that's what it says here. Um... And then the burrito is going to be 8,888. What I think we're going to end up doing is we can print a burrito with a res pound. So it's a om, om nugget, a res pound, a leek, and a squashothane. I guess I got to figure out how much the Noxo, Noxomation 2 is. How much is that? That one is also 518. Okay. Okay, so I think what we're gonna have to do is print one of these burritos. So, Res Pound, Leek, Squashothane, and Omni Nugget. Squashothane is right here, okay. So I guess the Squashothane is worth picking up so we can make the burritos. And let's print a burrito. Look at that, we got a burrito. And that is going to give us 8,888 payload. That is crazy. Now, I think before we start sending some of this stuff up, um, let's start making a pile of things that we're going to need for the burrito manufacturing. So we're going to need, obviously, the Om Nuggets. We're going to need the Leeks as well. I want to say the other thing was... What was the other thing? Uh, Squashothane and Res Pound. We got plenty of Res Pound, so that's no big deal. Uh, we needed the squash o thing is the other thing that we needed. But one thing that uh, seemed pretty important were those caches down there that I didn't know what they opened or what they did. Um, but we have a whole thing of dynamite here, and I want to find out. So we're going to go down, and if those things give us burritos just by using a dynamite, that is going to be the way to go to get to what we need to get to. So... We need to clean up this mess at some point too, but that's future Lukeness's problem. And I think we're also going to send off a payload here, so I think we're going to avoid sending off anything that we can use to manufacture the burritos, like this stuff here. But everything else, like the Cosmic Squash and the Noxothane, we don't really need. Uh, so we're going to send that. We're going to send that stuff off, but the stuff needed to make the uh, burritos we'll keep. So I will start actually just loading all this stuff onto. Uh, the request platform. See how many loads we can get, how many points we can get for it. That's gonna give us 12,000. That is insane. What the heck just... What in the glitch just happened? Did it give me my points for that? All this stuff just fell off. Did it, did it receive my points or did it just decide to leave? What the heck just happened? Oh, it gave me more stuff too. It gave me more stuff too and it didn't take my... So it looks like all the the rest of the stuff on here we're probably gonna wanna keep, so... Uh, we'll send this one off right here. And uh, we got our... 
Got this this guy ready to go for the next trip. Throw one of these guys on here. And of course we'll load this guy up with all the dynamite. So now this thing is fully loaded with dynamite. I think we are going to bring one of these medium... We might bring... I think I'm going to start with just one medium resource canister for now. We're going to bring that with us and see if there's an abundance of like a resource we can put in there. Because we're definitely going to need them. Okay, let's go down and see what this dynamite does. Uh, we are going to go ahead and try to blow up one of these caches too. There's two right here, so hopefully this... Maybe we can put all three of them together. Because yeah, there's a third one over here too. So I'm going to dig this out, pick it up. We'll set it right here. We'll set this one right here. I'm hoping this is not too close to my... That almost killed me. Hoping this is not too close to my rover, but we're going to try. Okay. I'm going to light this and I'm going to run. Run. What did that get us? What did that get us? Unknown biofuel? No way! I wasted a dynamite just for some res pound and some unknown biofuel, right? There's no way! That's all that was in there? Why would you even make me waste a dynamite on that? Okay, well, we're gonna open this one up. Last time we did this, it was a winch. It's another winch. I'm gonna try to do another uh, explosion, see if that works. See if we get anything different, but if it doesn't, then I'm just gonna give up with the dynamite because it's not worth wasting it. So we will grab another dynamite. Run. What did it get? Nothing? Or is all the stuff still falling? Oh, okay, so maybe it was a cosmic bobble. Yeah, give me some cosmic bobbles. Noxothane. And I guess maybe a leak? That stuff went everywhere. Maybe that's not a good idea. So I guess right now we're gonna focus on the snowmen, uh, the leaks, and these ones have seemed to be giving me some pretty good stuff. Yeah. So we'll focus on that stuff too. So one thing I have to remember, uh, we also need the uh, one of the, like the biofuel things. I don't remember the name of it specifically, but we do need to keep an eye out for that as well. But yeah, so if we are gonna mass produce the burritos, we are gonna need some more of the squash thing, and we're gonna figure out where to get that again, because I kind of forgot. I believe it was up on the mantle though. And so I think I might just drive around looking for snowmen as well as the gold uh, caches because the gold caches are going to help us out a lot. Gold snowman. That's new. What is in a gold snowman? Oh, okay. Okay, we'll see what's in here. Give me a burrito? Oh, another winch! I think they're just rubbing it in my face now. They're trying to be mean to me. And I guess we're, like I said, we're pretty much out of spots on a rover. So right now, I am just going to drive around until I find the gold leak caches. Because that's what I need. Like that one right there. That worked out pretty well. Because that's what we need right there. There's another gold one right here. Let's open this guy up. That's what I need. Let's open this guy though. This is what we want. Pop. Yeah, the more the merrier. Come on. Alrighty, so we made it back to base and we got a lot of stuff. So uh, we're going to start, I guess, mass producing these, uh, these burritos and we'll see what happens. And we're going to just start printing these. That is four burritos right there. Let's throw all of these on and see what a load of four burritos looks like. It's giving us 35,000 payload. That's huge. So we'll send that off real quick. Now, uh, it looks like the big thing we're gonna need to start getting more of is squashothane, which I don't think is too hard to get. We might be able to mass produce it too. So let me look. That is going to do it 
for this video of Astro Nerd. If you guys did enjoy, hit the like button and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next one. In the next one, we are going to refine our mass production of burritos and uh, hopefully get the uh, the re the final reward in the next episode. But that is going to do it for this one. Hit the like button, subscribe if you did enjoy, and I'll see y'all in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching.